Wow. I have absolutely, without a doubt, the best followers ever. So, a while back, I had shown you my previous collection because I had just gotten Haruka and Chibiusa from the uh, third wave of these keychains and these uh, clips and such. And I said that because the, um, the third series, which focuses more on their school attire, was just so hard to get a hold of that I didn't really see myself finishing off the collection right away. And I showed you guys in my video how I was just happy to have Haruka and Chibiusa, and that was kind of it. And I kind of figured, you know, that would be the end of it. Well, right after I published my last video on this, I got flooded. I got comments on Facebook. I got comments in my email box. I got comments on my video from people who were helping me finish off this collection and cheaply too. I really did not think I was going to have this collection finished off at all. And all of you pulled together and you scoured the internet, you found eBay sales, Mercari, you went as just above and beyond as far as you guys could to help me find the missing figures at a really super affordable price. And I really just want to say thank you. Thank you for following me. Thank you for helping me finish this collection off. And thank you because you guys did an awful lot of work helping me pull this off. I am really grateful for each and every one of my subscribers. I really am. And all of my followers, too. You guys went absolutely way past above and beyond to try and help me. And I really am just so grateful. Thank you guys so much. It's because of you that this video right now is being filmed. So let's take a look now that we've got all the guys and girls together. Um... Let's see the first three waves of these uh, keychains. I did notice that some of them came as clips and some of them came as keychains. And let's see, does it actually say? Yeah, it kind of says on the bag if you're getting a clip or a keychain. This one came with Diana, so it was a clip. But, you know, I wasn't really focused on this part. I was just more focused on the figure part. So I thought that was interesting. Uh, somebody on Facebook let me know that select hot topics get different bags. I heard that there were game stops that just had the key rings. My hot topic only had key rings for the first two series. And then there were some people where they never found the clips at GameStop, but they did find them at their hot topics. So Throwing a guess out there, I'm guessing it's a regional thing. Um, I didn't know there was a difference until I started getting the last few figures, but now I see for myself there's clips and key rings. So that's pretty interesting. So starting from the top, of course you guys remember the Moonstick and the Holy Grail and Luna and Artemis. And now I've got Diana. This was the last one. There was only one seller on eBay that had her, and one of my followers sent me straight to her, and I am forever grateful, because Diana is my favorite of the cats. I love Diana and Artemis. And then there's Luna P, of course. And then, you know, you really do start to see the differentium with a lot of colors, because, like, they could have just given, for example, Isagi the same brooch across the board, they chose not to. Her Sailor Moon one has her original brooch. Her school uniform actually has... Let's get that in the camera. Look at all the detail work. That's her R brooch right there. And then Super Sailor Moon gets her S brooch. Isn't that neat? Chibiosa, Chibi Moon, and Black Lady are all slightly different in coloring. You can kind of see it in the camera. Like, this one here has more of a baby pink in her hair. This one's like a bubblegum pink. And this one's a little more dusty. And then let's check out the inners now that everybody's together. So there's Ami. 
And I didn't catch this, but they gave her in the third series her correct blue eyes. And then here they gave her like sort of tealish hair and these purple eyes, just like in the Play a Sound book. You guys remember me reading this, right? That is a neat throwback, and I didn't even catch that before. And of course, codename Sailor V. Here's Minalco. He even carved her little pocket in there. Ray, there's a difference with two, because like here, she's got her correct purple eyes. And wow, I didn't even catch this now that I'm seeing it in the camera. Look at all the details. Look at that. How did they do that? That's so cool. Whereas her Mars figure has just straight up black eyes. Makoto looking adorable with green eyes. Haruka has the biggest change. Because like a Sailor Uranus, they give her her manga hair coloring, which is very, very light blonde, almost white. But here they give her her 90s anime coloring with the dark blonde. And then here's Michiru. And you know, something I was thinking about, like, she wears headbands a lot in her uh, civilian attire. Oh, that's neat. They actually put her Mugen star there. Can you see that? There's a little black star there. But I was thinking, like, you know, she transforms and she goes from having a headband to a tiara. I kind of wish they had kept the headband as part of her outfit. I think that's a cute little look. Hotaru has different eyes, too. Like, here are her... She's got, like, these violet eyes, and then here she's got, like, true purple eyes. Her hair's slightly different shape, too. Like, here, it's shorter, like you see in Crystal, and it's, it's closer to her head. And it's, like, slightly lighter, not by much. And then here, her hair's, like, more full, and it's a little longer. And Setsuna and Sailor Pluto. And, of course, Queen Barrel. I love that there's more Queen Barrel stuff, don't you? I am just so thrilled to have this entire collection. I guess they're still going to be doing more of these because I just found out that there's a fourth set out, but it's just the girls standing in front of their symbols, and it's some of the transformation wands. So... I have not seen them yet at Hot Topic. I'm just going to wait to see, you know, when the prices go down some, because, you know, I, I am kind of on a budget. But I really just want to thank you guys again for helping me find so many of these girls, because thanks to you, I have all of Series 3 now, and it just looks so cool. I hope they keep making these. I hope they go into, like... The, uh, the Sailor Stars, and I hope they go into the Amazonas Quartet. You know, wouldn't, wouldn't a Chibi Chibi like this be really cute? But anyway, thank you guys so much for helping me, and I'll see you soon.